What's up guys and welcome to The Escapist. This is a game that's been sitting around on Steam in early access and is about to uh, release as a full version and this is gonna be a little mini series on it and if you don't know what that means, stick around and I'll explain it in a moment. But The Escapist is a fun little game where you are a person in jail, a jailer, and your goal is to escape. <laughs> it's a really interesting concept. We're gonna be starting a new game and just sort of getting to the hang of it. I'm very, very new to the game. We are not a rabbit. Of course, we are a zebra. So let's head in and hopefully everything works out pretty well. I did the tutorial already, so we're not gonna be doing that. And like I said, I'm really still pretty fresh to this game. So if I don't do that well, I do apologize, but hopefully this will be a learning experience. Welcome to the to Center Perks, the most comfortable low security prison in the country. On on behalf of all staff here, we wish you a happy and relaxing visit. Should you get bored of the complimentary cable TV, we pride ourselves in many other engaging activities around the grounds. Is this a jail or is this a vacation suite? <laughs> I'm not really sure. Okay then, so prison life is all about routines. By sticking by them, you'll keep the guards off your back. And we do have a desk, we can pick it up and start a riot, or we can just get the stuff out of it, which I'll do now. And then we're gonna walk over to um, where, oh, every morning it seems like they call us up, they round everybody up, just sort of do a bit of a roll call and see who's who. Right then. You gonna say anything important? The following are do a cell toss. Tasty and Gill, neither of those are us, so we're in the clear for now. In here, life is easy. If your name is pulled for a shakedown at a roll call, make sure your desk is free of contraband. Okay, well we don't have anything contraband. These are all good items, these are nice items. If they were bad, they'd have like red text to them. More escapists return here by choice. Someone broke into the storage unit, okay. That reminds me. I guess he won't finish his sentence. <laughs> See you, buddy. But yeah, this is a mini series. So what that means is that we're going to be playing it as much as we want. If that's one episode, okay. If that's five episodes, okay. If that's 500 episodes, okay. The goal is to provide as much as you guys are interested in. So if you see this first episode and you're dying to see more, make sure to let me know. And if you aren't really into it and you don't, we'd rather not it be uploaded anymore, let me know. And that's really what the series is all about. And we learn all about what we should and shouldn't upload. And it's like, if I'm in the mood to post 500 videos of it, I will, but there's no like, you know, meaning to finish the game. That's not, never the goal. It's just to play as much as you guys want to see. There we go, we just ate our breakfast, or probably our canned beef or something like that. But now it's our free period, so we can start talking to people. He can sell things, he has a weapon. I don't wanna mess with him, Mr. Jamal. Um, he has some things to sell. He has a sheet of metal, a bar of chocolate, a file, and then a razor blade. Some of these things I know what they do, and some of them I do not. How is a razor blade not a weapon? But either way, I would look for somebody with a quest. Now they usually have little exclamation points over their head. So let's see if we can hunt anybody down to see if they need any help. Hey, you, let's talk to you. Hey, no, get back here, get, get, no, no, talk to you. I suspect the recent heat on me is coming from Tasty. Give him a good hidden, or uh, hidden? Good hidden, and I'll see you right. I'm guessing like hitting him? Um, I really don't know if I have the energy or the abil ability to really knock anyone out, but I'll give it a, a shot. It's gonna be tasty. <laughs> it's so weird, it's like we're in jail. These stinking humans got us. They finally found, figured out I was a zebra doing things like driving cars and paying bills. They're like, zebras can't do that, and they arrested me. It's, it's ridiculous, but we can go over to our journal and beat up tasty for Redford. All right then, and we can also check our uh, crafting notes, which we don't have much of, and then we can actually craft items. So if I want to combine toothpaste with soap to get the weirdest thing ever, it won't work. But if I had something worth combining, I would be able to do it there. So let's look for, what's his name? Uh, Tasty. It's sort of a weird name, but if we find Tasty, I might just try beating him up a bit. <laughs> I don't have much to beat him up with. I mean, maybe I could hit him with a toothbrush. And I do see somebody else with a, um. A little challenge here. Tasty, oh, it's tasty. Let's beat him up after we take his quest. Officer Whitney's trying to extort my earnings again. Last time I beat down solve that. Maybe it will again, you wanna do it? Sure. Now, the thing is, is right now we need like money to be able to um, actually afford some weapons or something. And you. Officer Stewart failed to honor his side of our little look the other way deal. Fancy laying a beat down on him? Sure. I'm gonna have a bad with the cops soon enough because we're definitely beating up a lot of cops, it seems. Um, 
Let's talk to you. He has a weapon. I wish I could take that. Um, the number one way I've found to actually get weapons is wait for two other inmates to get into a fight and then steal their stuff when nobody's looking. <laughs> It's sort of a hilarious lowdown way, but um, there's a lot of people walking around. Ugh, smells like something died. Maybe it will be you soon, buddy. Don't look at me the wrong way, or it will be. Okay, it's lunch. After our free time, we're able to eat some more. The lunch seems pretty pointless. Maybe it's just sort of a planning time, like where you can just sort of plan what you want to do next. Everybody starts pouring in to get their food. Their nom noms. Will you keep it down while I savor the flavor? <laughs> Imagine having real food. Yeah, not this like plastic stuff. There's a fly in my match. Aw, awful this is. I guess it is. I mean, jail food isn't supposed to be good. All right then, so like, I don't think we have anything worth combining that can actually make something. I would really like to grab a sock and then combine that with the soap. That'll make a sock mace. And that's really powerful from what I've seen. Um. With that being said, we just need to keep talking to people with um, things to sell. Um, but they all clump up like this and it's sort of annoying to find the one I want to talk to. He has a screwdriver, but that's wicked expensive. So for this point, we need to do our job. And our job is to do laundry, as you can see over here. So let me, can I move stuff in my inventory? I guess I can. Either way, all we have to do is get stuff in here, put it in the wash, and then wait for it to wash, and then grab it out of the wash, and then put it in the dry, in the, in the clean laundry. There's actually no dryer here, so we just throw it in soaking wet. <laughs> That's okay, though. They sort of um, chilled it down so it didn't have to be so complex, and I don't mind. All right, then. Oh, wait, I just, I just did something bad. <laughs> Let's take that, and then do this, and then that, and then do this. In the bottom right, you can see the job quota. So we need to do this fast enough so that we're not um, lagging around here and actually get it done. So let's just keep working. We do have some time on the bottom left to figure out when we gotta figure f finish it up. But like I said, I'm pretty new at this game, so if you do have any tips, or maybe you're just an expert at the game or something, and you'd like to let me know some things to get myself started, I would really appreciate the info. All that kind of stuff is really super duper helpful. So let's keep on putting this up. I noticed that there are cop outfits in the laundry here. Hey, what's up, Mr. Levi? See ya. I guess he's just checking up on me, but um, yeah, maybe we can use that to somehow escape is using the uh, police outfits. Who knows, but either way, our job code is done, so I, I could run around if I wanted to, but I think they'll yell at me still. So maybe that's not the best idea. I wanna, I wanna check up on this dude. Yo, dude, what are you up to? Oh, I, I'm not allowed in. Uh, I wanted to trade, oh, I can't, oh, I'm out of range. Oh, darn it. Let's talk to um G Xavier, how do you say that? I've been tailing a thieving rat for days and worked out his routine. Distract the guards at next exercise period for me so I can check his stash. I don't know if I wanna do that, no thanks. Um, But I, you do see a little thumbs down when you decline people's uh, quests, so I think that that'll actually make them hate you a little. But let's um do a little more then. Just for the heck of it. But um, I noticed now we have 50 cash. I think that's actually from doing our job because I didn't have that cash before. So that's good. We do get a little extra money, which it's also an interesting concept too that they're giving the prisoners money. <laughs> you think that's the last thing you'd be interested in giving prisoners. But there's um internet and can I go and just like browse the web? Browsing the web will re or reading a library will increase your I intellect. Okay, that, let's do this a little bit. We need to actually um not do that though because we need to um you go over here and start getting them gains, start working out all nice and good. <laughs> Come on now, we can do it, we can do it, just keep wrapping it up. Come on, get them big muscles and flex around all cool like. <laughs> but you can see in the top left here, you can actually get fatigue. So we don't wanna push ourselves too far, we might throw up everywhere and that'd be gross. Trim that beard, I'm not even trimming a beard here, dude. I'm working out, you're telling me weird stuff. This guy's just watching us though, Mr. Gary. There's a workout session for today. That does increase our health from the looks of it, which is pretty cool. It seems Aiden acts a friendship lately where just a cover to get his hands on my poster. Fancy getting it back for me? This is something I think we can do. Um, This is Aiden. So let's try to find Aiden. And is Aiden selling anything? Because sometimes they'll just be selling what they took. But that eh, doesn't seem to be the case here. Um, Yeah, he doesn't have it, so. Um, let's see what our quests are and what we should do now. Beat up Toasty for Red Bird. Um, I can try that, but it's gonna be really difficult without like some good stuff. Oh, here comes a fight. <laughs> beat him up, boys, beat him up. 
if somebody's down for the count. Now I'm just gonna sort of wait around for the, the people to clear out of the shower. I'm gonna snag that dude's stuff. <laughs> They're gonna be mine. And the drains are clogged. Okay then. Oh, I know you weren't just blah blah blah. They all just babble and talk all the time. All smack talk. But what is it? this guy has a glass shank? That looks painful. He has a screwdriver though, but I don't want to trade anything in front of the cops and in front of the coppers. That won't be good. I, don't, I did see a lighter, I wonder if we can make a Molotov. There we go, and oh well, so funny. Oh gosh, she got up before I was able to snag anything. If you snag something in front of the cops, they will beat you up. If it isn't something like contraband, you get to keep it though. So maybe it would have been worth picking up. But either way, like, so we can beat up Toasty, we can beat up o Officer Whitney for Toasty. So maybe we should do something for Toasty and then beat him up. Just the ultimate <laughs> letdown for him. So like, where is Toasty? He's right there, and then we're looking for Officer, Officer Whitney. So that is, ooh, ooh. Uh, he's not out around here, so maybe we can find him soon. For now though, we'll just eat up. Shouldn't take too long. Can I just like leave though? Like that's the thing, it seems like the, the cops will scold you. Ooh, I can take forks and things. I didn't know you could do that, okay. So maybe I can go sit back down? Maybe I'll use, a plastic knife or something. Maybe I can, um... Oh, what's going on here? Officer Marcus, that's not what I was looking for. Um, oh, he's down. I'll quickly steal some of his stuff. No, 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 I didn't want to do that. I wanted to, um, place these things on it because I don't really need them. Roll of toilet paper, pack of mints. Um, let's take the pack of mints and hand cream because those are both new items to me. Now, he's beating him up. Just gonna watch the fun here. The cops are way stronger, as you can see. And then when nobody's looking, what do you have? Teddy bear. Ooh. <laughs> And then nails. Um, oh, I wish you would stay down for longer. Maybe I could just, you know, I'm taking you with me. See it? <laughs> See ya, I'm just taking you with me, buddy. <laughs> I need to go back to my cell so I can find myself a, um, or just get some stuff. So you, you go down there. I'm gonna place, oh wait, is this, I thought this was my cell. No? Well, wh where's my cell? I, I, I don't know. I'm lost, somebody get me a map. Um, maybe it's up here? What happened to my cell? I don't know. Oh, here it is. Found it, guys. No worries. No worries. Well, this is this is my this is Steve's desk. Well then, what is he gonna like? Where's mine? No, I want my my cell. So it was this one, but it just oh this time it lets me in. It's a little weird. Um, so we're going to uh, put all of our stuff in here because I'm running out of space here. So let's do 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 do. There you go. <laughs> Getting all that cool stuff, but we gotta be careful. Wait, who is this? This is Officer Stewart. That's Officer Whitney, though. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Snag. Uh, tub of bleach. Oh, I'll take the sock mace. Thank you for the sock mace. No, 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 no. No, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. It was the other guy. It was the other guy. No, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Ah! No! Help! Help! Somebody! I'm being attacked by a cop. Oh no! Wait, is this Officer Whitney? No, it's not. Darn it! If it was Officer Whitney, Whitney, this would be so much easier. But it's not. Leave me alone, you big jerk. Oh no. Oh no, indeed. What do I do about this? Um, maybe I could quickly go in here and then do this. No, 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 no. Um, put that in there. There you go. Now, hopefully, they don't search my desk in the next night. But <laughs> there is so much going on right now. It's ridiculous. Then we do have a tub of bleach. I don't know what we're gonna be using that for, but I mean, our job is to be one of the um laundry dude, so maybe it'll help out. But now we have a sock mace, so maybe we could actually use that to attack somebody somewhere somehow. Um, for now though, is he still after me? No, he sort of gave up, which is pretty interesting. But um, let's go and take the sock mace. And now it's becoming nighttime, so we gotta prepare for the worst here. And It is now the evening roll call, so we're going to actually equip this really quick. Hopefully nobody sees us do that. And then let's uh, go out for roll call. What do you guys gotta say, coppers? Everybody's chilling around there. Count time. I think we're missing a few people. Oh, here they are. Those do a cell shakedown are as following. Well, we, Stephen Xavier, or Xavier, I don't know how to pronounce it. Apparently someone escaped but soon returned. Someone exciting new, some exciting news for you all. We heard you the first time. <laughs> Warren's hat down the dead, that's the biggest offense. Someone dumped 
the pond. <laughs> Weird stuff happening in this jail. But yeah, um, none of these are Whitney. I need to find Whitney. The hunt for Whitney continues. By the way, it is now nighttime. We can now sleep to save our progress. And with that being said, I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy, make sure to, like I said, let me know what you think about Escapist. Would you like to see more? Either way, we'll see you next time when we beat up, hopefully, Officer Whitney. See you guys. Bye-bye.